Okay, everybody. My name is Jeremy, and this is week two of the uh, immersive application deployment. So let's go ahead and launch my app. As you can see here, Moby Zen is actually cutting off part of my screen, um, but it shouldn't affect the video as I'm just going to show basics of the game so that way I can explain what I'm going to implement as the leaderboards. So my game is a 2D shooter. At the moment, you have to put your finger on the screen and then fire, and it'll actually fire the people. So the kill count on the top left, turn that down, is actually going to always keep score. So the kill streak, as you noticed, will go down. And you can see here, still having some issues with shooting the gun, but the kill count always stays the same so I'm gonna be using that as the way to count the leaderboard um, so whoever has the most kills before they run out of health or the timeline um, I haven't decided depends on how far I can get with making the tank move um, so that will basically be how I'm gonna use the leaderboard and I'm probably gonna use Google Play game services for it um, still gotta figure out um, if you need to be a dev uh, developer or have a developer account with them or not, I have to find that out. But if it is possible, I want to use the Google Play game services. And the filters, my game is more of a arcade style game, so I want to have similar leaderboards as you would on the arcade, except since it is mobile, I want to have a filter for day, week, month, um, something somewhere around there. I want to have a filter based on time. So that way you can see if you're the best that month or the best overall or the best that year. Somewhere in that category is how I want the, the filters to be played out. And how many leaderboards do I plan on using for the game? Overall right now, for the game the way it is, only one. Eventually it might be nice to put one per level depending on how the game matures from this point. But for this class we're only looking at one level and I'm only looking at one leaderboard right now. Um, with of course three different types of filters on there. And that is basically what we're going to be looking at from my, what I'm going to be working on this weekend as well as the next week for my application. And I'm probably thinking of placing the leaderboard somewhere on the main screen, um, on the menu screen somewhere. So we'll see how that ends up and see where I place it. And I'll see you guys all next week.